Hey there, Internet! Welcome to the Sandpulse channel. Today we are going to talk about cold marketing and why you should avoid it like the plague. So get a warm coffee and let's get going! Cold emailing is like the old school equivalent of showing up uninvited to someone's house, ringing their doorbell and then trying to sell something they don't want. Cold emails are not worth the effort. Right now I should probably tell you about the cold email open rate, but I believe the open rate is not that essential when it comes to cold emails. It shows the deliverability picture, but not the effectiveness of such campaigns. What counts more is the response rate. Based on the research by QuickMail, around 50% of cold email campaigns have a reply rate of under 10%, with a CTR of 3.75%. A journalist Shane Snow once carried out experiment. He sent 1,000 cold emails to C-level executives at 500 companies. The response rate was 1.7%, with only one respondent providing a helpful reply. Not that inviting, in my opinion. But they still have replies, you might say. Yes, but at what cost? You spend money to send a campaign, instead the recipients might mark your email as spam because they don't know you. So basically, you just pay for your sender reputation getting in danger. Why do marketers use cold email marketing? Well, the main reason is that it's cheap. It's much cheaper to send 100 emails than to run a Facebook or Google AdWords campaign. And if you get a few sales from those 100 emails, it can be worth the effort. But here's the catch. Cold email marketing rarely works. People are bombarded with emails daily. Most go straight to the trash folder. And if you do manage to get someone to open your email, they are probably going to delete it as soon as they realize it's a sales pitch. It's not only annoying, but can also have severe consequences for your brand reputation and wallet. So why should good marketers avoid cold marketing? There are a few reasons. First of all, it's just not effective. As I said earlier, most people are going to delete your email without even reading it. And if they do read it, they're probably not going to buy your product or service. In fact, they might even develop a negative opinion of your brand if they feel you are spamming them. Secondly, it's unethical. People don't want to receive unsolicited emails from companies they've never heard of. It's intrusive and annoying. And in most countries, it's even illegal. And finally, it's just bad for your brand. If you're constantly sending out spammy emails, people are going to start associating your brand with spam. And that's not a good look. Just imagine if someone posted a negative review about your brand online, saying that re they received spammy emails from you. That's not the kind of publicity you want for your business. What should you do instead of cold email marketing? Well, there are a few things you can do. First of all, focus on building your email list. You want to have a list of people who have opted in to receive emails from you. This means they are already interested in what you have to offer, so they are more likely to open and engage with your emails. You can add pop-ups to your website, inviting users to subscribe to your newsletters. By the way, there is a video on our channel on how to use pop-ups in your business. Check it out and remember to subscribe to the Samples channel. We have new videos and webinars coming every week. Secondly, create valuable content that people want to read. This could be blog posts, videos, or even free ebooks or guides. When you provide value to people, they are more likely to trust you and want to do business with you. Don't wait till people look for the unsubscribe option in your newsletters or chatbot. Ask them what they would like to read. Spice it up with a little discount or another special offer. This always works. Third, personalize your content. Remember to bring personalized content. For this, use segmentation, run surveys, study the bias journey, and use automation. This is a surefire way to deliver the right content to the right customer at the right moment. With samples, you can segment your mailing list based on things like interest, location, and behavior. This means you can send more relevant and useful emails to your subscribers. Samples also makes automation easy with all sorts of communication channels and variables to use. Get started for free! So, to sum it up, 
Cold email marketing is cheap, but it's also ineffective, unethical and bad for your brand. Instead, focus on building your email list, creating valuable content and using email marketing software like Sandpulse to create targeted and personalized campaigns. In the meantime, I thank you for watching this video and encourage you to check our channel for more marketing tips. See you in the next video. Bye!